good. Here we go to the main event. This is a request. It's been requested a long time ago. Brian May is an exclusive Hollywood Records recording artist. He did the Brian May Queen done a song for this. This is Rise of the Robots, requested by somebody, <coughs> a friend of mine, said their friend requested this game. It's very important I get their name right who requested it, because you know normally I don't bother. So here we go. It's the most, most overhyped game of all time. It's Rise Robots, as requested by, let's think who it was, LR Marsh Rats. Yeah, that's it. LR Marsh Rats. Are you out there? LR Marsh Rats requested this. It's definitely LR Marsh Rats. Not LR Marshalls or LR Kung Fu or hello, what are you doing? My name is Bob. This is LR Marsh Rats. This is Rise of Robots. This is a game which, uh, if you ever watched Bad Influence, was the intro. It provided most of the graphics for their little intros or whatever. That was a British program, computer program, with Andy Crane, the most boring twat on the planet. So Rise of Robots like this revolutionary beat em up game with graphics like space age graphics. You've never seen graphics like this. This is like, this is taking games to a new dimension, I tell you. <coughs> Turned out though, all this hype about the world's greatest graphics. And look at this intro, look at this shit. Is this shit? Made all these amazing graphics with like, I don't know, 3D Studio, what they use, these graphical bastards use. And I forgot to actually make a good game out of it. This is the days where CDs were coming out and people were getting carried away by graphics and video footage and stuff. Actual gameplay didn't mean a lot, but the reviewers, to be fair to them at the time, they realised a shit game when they saw it. This game is basically shit on a stick. Shit on a shit sized stick. It reeks of shit. It reeks. It's a stick that's been stuck up the arse of a shithole. Not a cunt, really. Not a cunt. Look at this. So you got a game. You got basic graphics here. I'll pause the game. It's always a good start. So you got a punch move. You're robots. The good thing is, you can turn around and face the other way. Oh, you can actually in this game. I'm pretty sure in the original PC game, you couldn't face the other way, which is... It's always a bit of a bad start to the game. So here we go, Mr. Marsh Rat. Mr. Donkey Kong, Mr. Bastard's Ass, whoever you are. This is the game you requested. Enjoy it. Enjoy me beating the shit out of this very poorly animated robot. The graphics are rubbish. On the PC, there was two versions of this. There was like a low resolution game and a high resolution game. It came on CD-ROM, which is back in them days. It was like a, it was like a revelation back then. CD-ROM? A CD-ROM? A, a game on a CD? You're fucking out a bath, aren't you? No, you weren't. This is what the game came on. So I'll, I'll get me ask it to you. I'm doing all my special moves. My special move is a punch. I think my special move is dying. Now this is shit. There was a game. It's called uh, One Must Fall 2097 by Apogee or somebody. And that was a really good game. That was like a bit like this, but it was actually quite good. You got loads of robots. You could upgrade and all that sort of shit. And the best bit of it was I actually managed with a hex editor, with no prior skill, just to randomly hack into it and change all my stats to the maximum. And that. I was quite impressed with that using X3 Gold. X3 Gold. Did anyone know that? No, of course you don't. Fucking lived, have you? X3 Gold, fucking hell, no. Emos Dos 4, what was that, eh? Fucking hell. You've, you your Vista and your XP, you know what's going on? So here we go, look at this game. Punch you in the face, you piece of shit. Should we be making a Citroen Picasso or something, you bloody yellow thing? I've seen you on the adverts. Get fucking making that car. No one, there's no one there to buy the cars these days, are there, to be fair? Who's buying a car? The government are giving away two grand. If you buy, if you trade in your old car for a new car, what's the fucking point? Your old car, use that. This game is shit. This program by Shit McCoy. Take that. Look at the look at the defence he's using. Got ya. Take that and that and have some of that. 
I ran out of time. I've lost, have I? I've lost. That's a real fucking shame. I've lost. It was such a close combat. Look at this, look. Oh, God. What a pile of shit. Sorry, Mr. Marsh Rat, Mr. Henry Henry, whoever your name is. I don't know who your name is. Your friend recommended me players for you. That's the best bit. This is the best bit of the whole game. That robot there. Look at him. He looks like a hard bastard, but he's not. You get a giant magnet out. He sticks to it. You've, you've fucked him. you fucked him over. A giant magnet. A bit of water. <coughs> he's made of iron, for fuck's sake. A bit of water. A bit of air. A bit of, he turns into fucking rust. Rubbish. Two out of ten. Piece of shit. Why do you request these? Why do you request these games for fuck's sake? What's the matter with you? Fucking hell. Make me swear, you son of a bitch. Anyway, two out of ten. How do I get out of this?